took a car, you know, kind of prepped myself for an interview for a couple of uh, mm-hmm. few months. And then I hop into just and then now I'm a Splunk. I work as a Splunk engineer. Uh, first, uh, Bertrand, tell us a little bit about your background. Actually, I've, I've been in IT for a couple of years, about seven years. Mm-hmm. Um, then, but I was all doing more of uh, project management, you know, mm-hmm. get myself into the analysis. And then um, I got myself introduced into Splunk. That was um, 2016. Mm-hmm. All right. So, yeah. But then I had still trying to take a couple of certifications, trying to get some good right. knowledge first, get into the field. When you were doing your job hunt, how exa- what kind of challenges did you face over there? Uh, you know, the kind of challenges I kind of faced was, um, you know, in me in a meeting and people talking about Splunk and I mm-hmm. couldn't understand, talking yeah. about different and all that, um, kind of just connect the point. It was difficult for me to do that. Um, mm-hmm. Through some couple, some couple of documentation, trying to mm-hmm. grab myself, you know, get myself up to date. But then uh, it wasn't it, so I had to go back to class and take some cars. Fair enough. Took a car, you know, kind of prep myself for an interview for a couple of uh, mm-hmm. few months, and then I hop and just and then now I'm a Splunk. I work as a Splunk engineer. Well, nice. And uh, since your objective has been met, now, since you are in a full time Splunk role, right? Um, yeah. I just want to know if you have any suggestion which you want to give to all the viewers out there. Because a lot of people have dilemmas when it comes to career transitions in their path. So what kind of suggestion would you give to these learners to have a successful transition? Um, I mean, uh, it's just about taking up the bull by the horn, not going and say, hey, you got to knock this out and do whatever you got to take and, okay. you know, and do the assignments, or you know, especially the the, the exercise right. always give very good and right. ask questions. I was, I, I'm always that kind of student who was over very inquisitive in class, ask a lot of questions, mm-hmm. what I don't understand. Okay. Anyways, thank you so much for your valuable time, Burton. All right. All right. Have a good one. Have a good one, sir. You too.